but really pretty much everything out here was was pasture farming cattle citrus uh, and after about quarter to six in the evening when we had just built the station the Braden Wood station uh, you could go out there about quarter to six in the evening and put your lawn chair out there there just wasn't wasn't any traffic it was two lanes one lane each way so we've seen quite a bit of growth out here challenges that we face as, as we have been facing for a while is certainly the growth in the area out east here um, as that growth continues it doesn't seem like it's going to slow down anytime soon but we're also experiencing a lot of our uh, veterans are beginning to get to retirement age and now we're having to uh, you know do double duty with training our, our uh, midline folks to move up, our first line supervisors move up to mid-level staff, our firefighters. So, you know, the challenge of trying to keep up with the community, trying to not only keep up with our level of service, but improve at the same time, and the challenge of uh, trying to uh, teach our firefighters for the next step and the advancement of their career here at East Manatee Fire Rescue. I think in closing, I'd just like to say that we have got a bunch of great employees and they are the ones that, that have made this place successful and uh, certainly made my job a lot easier over the years. And uh, I think the, the vast majority of the credit should be left to them because of the good job that they've done.